I think you're the most fabulous woman I've seen in my life. What? I love this. Okay, I can hear that one more time. I gotta hear that one more time. For the people in the back, I want them to hear me. What's your name? Alexa. Alexa? Yeah. I'm Vivian. I am loving this. Seriously, like I, I was already in heaven. Did you did you buy this for the premiere? Actually, this is all Latina owned and Latina made. So it first debuted at Latina Fest. And we kind of want to have it as like a little um, sisterhood of the traveling pants, if you will. Na Naive from Trend Talk had passed it down to me. And then this is from Moniso, uh, down, uh, in LA, uh, sorry, LA and Latina owned shop downtown. Oh my God, so everything is, is yes. in LA? Mm -hmm. I, I love, I love, love, love. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna go check them out. Can we? Yeah. Oh, so how was your experience, you know, sh from beginning to end? Nervous? Excited? Oh man, I think all of the emotions are here. I'm so proud of everyone. Proud of the girls. Proud of the pink ladies. Um, you know, I'm proud that all of us are really, like I was saying earlier, everyone's heart and soul has been into this series since I believe they all found out that they got to portray such epic and iconic roles. Um, I'm just excited. I'm, they all. It's you're in for a treat for sure, absolutely. From the T-Birds to the Pink Ladies to the iconic numbers and and wardrobe, the set. There's so many things. I can, I cannot wait. Do you have any any fa one favorite scene or number or even outfit from the entire series? I think I can check off all those. In this scene, I have no. I love relating with my family, my daughters and in the series, so you'll have to check that out. Uh, but just having that relationship with them and knowing it reminds me of my mom and having that iconic kind of two daughters where you're just, where I'm trying to assimilate, but then at the same time, they're showing me to really be true to who I am. It's a it's a beautiful thing. Kitty's really going, going, going through it with the girls and I love watching them grow. And I would say wardrobe wise, Everything I put on, I when we had wardrobe tests, I was just like, <laughs> "Can I take this? <laughs> Is this? I'm never taking this off." Yeah, it's it's absolutely stunning. You'll see that in the show. That little coat, absolutely stunning. And I just love working with everyone. On the, it's like a family, really. Yeah, I mean, you guys had to spend a lot of time together, right? So, but I imagine you know just constant nostalgia from the from Greece one and two. Did you have a favorite character from Greece one? From Greece one, because uh, I was gonna say Michelle Pfeiffer, Greece two. <laughs> uh, I would say, you know, I was just saying it changes too. And I'm gonna stick to this one right now because it's true to my soul, Marty. Marty? Yes. I love that. No one ever really recognizes that Marty is just so sexy and mischievous a little and isn't afraid to play a little bit with the with the flirtatiousness of it all. So Marty would fit right in these days. Super cool. She's super cool. Yeah, progressive and um, just they're all progressive, but I would say current. Yeah. Marty's still so current. Okay. So if you had to name a favorite character, not your own, from the from the series, I have to cut. You can tell. So we have to slide in there. Who would you name? My daughter. <laughs> Jane, I would say Jane is just, I'm so proud of her. Marissa Davila, as an actor in general, I'm so proud of her because she is, you know, leading this the, the cast and, and just so relatable with everyone. So just as a person, I love my girl Marissa and she's done such a stunning job. I can't wait for everyone to meet her, um, meet, meet Jane. No, that, that is a beautiful answer. I can't wait to see her myself. Thank you so much for taking the time to talk to us. <laughs> we are so excited to see this. And congratulations. It's going to be a hit. Thank you.